Hello, Chris at ePianos here. Today, I want to show you a really useful little tip, all to do with how you arrange the home screen on your CVP-809 or CVP-805. Make sure you're signed up to receive our weekly newsletter emails with tips like this and news and special offers, events, etc. Also check out our huge selection of pre-owned pianos on our website and new pianos too. So what I'm referring to is on the home screen of the uh, CVP 809 and 805 operating system, also the same actually for the 700 series, are the options down here at the bottom or the shortcuts as they're called because what we're seeing here are just shortcuts to what is already in the main menu, the sub menu here, of which there are loads and loads of options. But did you know that you can actually um, rearrange these and put different ones in there? Um, what I like to do, because I don't often use the Bluetooth facility, is change it for the chord looper function or indeed the playlist function, which is much more commonly used. Uh, and I also like to have the voice edit on here as well, but enough waffling. I'm going to show you how to do it and it's really, really easy. What you need to do is first of all, go into the main menu section just here and now find the option that you want to appear along the bottom in your shortcuts bar that you see on the home page. Now for the, instead of Bluetooth, what I want to have is playlist just here, much more commonly used one. And I don't want to have to keep going back into the menus to choose it. So what you do is you hold it down and look below all of this. All of these at the bottom will go brownish and there'll be an arrow just over them. So it's, it's now asking me, where do I want to put playlist? And I put it just here. I press where the Bluetooth is and there you go. It will now replace it with playlist. Now, the next one I wanted to put in there was the chord looper function, which I use quite often instead of the lyrics button. So again, hold down chord looper until everything goes brown like that. And then where it says lyrics in this case, press that and bam, chord looper will now go just there. Uh, repeat this for whatever else you want. I quite like to have my voice setting. Hold that down, all goes brown along the bottom instead of score. So press score once now and zip, down it goes onto the uh, shortcuts bar. Now go back to the home page and as you'll see, it is now set up as I've configured it. And even if I turn the piano off and back on again, it will all remain the same for next time. So really useful feature that you can have on this touchscreen operating system to make things a little bit easier to select and save you having to go through all the depths of the menu just there. Well, thanks very much for watching. I hope that was useful for you. Make sure you check out our other videos. If you have any comments or questions, just leave them down below this video. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.